Hey guys, Alco1093 here, and it is my birthday. It's my 19th birthday. It's been a good day. Um, a good amount of family came by. Some weren't able to make it, unfortunately. Um, but I've had a great day. And one of the th presents that I got today was a present that I got from my dad, which is Hanzo Tin. <laughs> I saw these in the um, in the shop like almost a month ago and I was like wait a second I haven't seen Yu-Gi-Oh cards in shops for like eight years nine years I haven't really been searching for them but for like eight years I haven't seen any Yu-Gi-Oh cards in shops and now I see both the Heliopolis tin and the Hanzo tin I'm like I want the Hanzo tin for my birthday dad go buy me one <laughs> so I haven't opened Yu-Gi-Oh packs in quite a while so ex please excuse me for my noobishness in opening the packs because there will be some noobishness. I believe the fifth card is the rare and the sixth one is something special. That's at least what I think it is. And for the rarities, I'm not really sure any rarities because I haven't opened packs since eight years ago. So that's why I have on my computer Wikipedia open with all three of the sets that I can get um, from this tin. So. So that would I get something special, and I want to know the rarity, I'm like, I'm going to check back for just a second, so please excuse my newishness. I may be an admin, I may know my rulings very well, I'm maybe a good duelist, but I'm a noob at opening Yu-Gi-Oh cards. I know my Pokemon stuff, but not that much about Yu-Gi-Oh, so let, let's get into this. Also, please enjoy the things that I put in the background right there, you probably will enjoy it. Alright, Hanzo Tin time. Always take something pointy with you if you're opening something like this. And I have my scissors. Helps with Pokemon, helps with Yu-Gi-Oh. No difference in that. Alright, really wondering what's in there. Since I haven't opened packs for so long, I only have one Synchro, which is Stygian Insurgents, but that was a promo that came with one of my World Championship games, I believe. I don't have any Xyzes. I know that number 16 Shockmaster is in here, but I haven't pulled any Synchro or... Um, Xyz is from a pack, which I kind of really want. I'm kind of thingy. Ah, advertisements. Alrighty. Stuff that is in here. Stuff is falling out. I'm going to try and keep this clean. The promos, of course. And this Hanzo tin is known for its very good promos. So, just in case you don't know... But they are, I'm gonna show them to you right now. Ninja Grandmaster Hanzo. Maxi. These look, these things look so shiny. I haven't had these shiny cards in this good condition since so long. I'm like really excited. And my first XC's monster ever. Woo! Number 16 Shockmaster. Okay, excited. And the infamous Rescue Rabbit. These could probably I probably have a couple of vanillas that I have two copies of somewhere in my old decks, like Two-Headed King Rex, Urabi. Now for Xyz is that I can that I can like actually work with them. Alright, let's put this aside for just a second because we are of course going to open the rest of the stuff that is in here. Return of the Duelist? What? Where did Return of the Duelist come from? Okay, because I had expected Photon Shockwave, then two Order of Chaos, and then two Galactic Overlords, but apparently it's different here. I heard that someone in, in Denmark, they do this as well, but okay, I did not expect this. I expected um, Photon Shockwave, so I have the wrong wiki page open. Well, um, let's think. Which came first, Overlord or Return of the Duelist? Pretty sure Return of the Duelist came after. If not, sorry, noobishness. Right, order of chaos time. Woo! All right, let's see what these packs bring me. For the Yu-Gi-Oh video, the few Yu-Gi-Oh videos that I've seen of people opening the Anzo tin, I have seen a lot of people that got some really good stuff, like some really good secret rares and all. And one person that could just that just got extremely unlucky. And this pack will not open. Sorry if this video is going to take a little longer. Okay, it's also noob and open Yu-Gi-Oh packs. 
Like the promo pack opened so easily. This just won't open. Okay, fine, scissors. Careful not cutting into the cards. I don't usually use scissors because they work fine if I just use my fingers, but... Alright, if I have to, I can always use the scissors. Ooh, my first sale cards. Let's see what I got. Alright, there's nine cards in a pack, I believe. One, two, three, yes, and... Five and six were special, so I'm going to leave those face down for now. Because that's what I do with Pokemon. Alright, Evil Sorterios. Insector Ant, Galaxy Storm, Zeal Weapon Unicorn Spear. Isn't that one of the special ones? Did I take out the wrong ones? Did I do something wrong? What rarity is a Unicorn Spear? I don't know. Be right back. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. Weapon. Couldn't find this this quickly, unfortunately. Okay, so apparently I got the wrong one. And then Centipede, that's a, like one of the best commons you can get from this deck. And ooh, Interplanetary Purply Thorny Dragon, I like that one too. Nice. But then, what did I do wrong with the order of the cards? Evils are Zelda! And Earth Armor Ninja, and I got Zelda. Don't know what the rarity is, sorry, but it looks shiny and it looks cool and stuff. But then, what did I do wrong? I thought it was the fifth and the sixth card. And I got one, two, three, three cards, and then I got the. Yeah, I probably picked one too early. Yeah. Alright, that's Solda and Unicorn Spear. That's nice. Alright. Yu Gi Oh! pack opener Noob Alka continues with his actions, going for Galactic Overlord. And you may hear it outside fireworks, because it's the 31st of December, so obviously people are going to shoot fireworks. You know what, I'm just going to do these all with scissors, because it's just easier, and I can't seem to get them open too easily. Oh. I don't want to cut into the card, so I'm really careful, but I can feel that they're not there, so let's do this. Alrighty, pack number two. Alright, so this is 9, 8, 7, so these are 6 and 5. Should be. If this doesn't work, there's something wrong. Alright, number 1 is Gauntlet, Erratic Seal of Supremacy, Lady of D, Gardner. And the Gardner is the 4th card, so de I'm definitely doing something wrong. I'm, it's probably the 4th and the 5th. Red-Headed Oni. Overlay Eater. And, oh yay, Doom Donuts. Uh, I got Doom Donuts. <laughs> this is a lol card, I don't know why. It makes me laugh every time I see it. I haven't seen it in any competitive deck at all, but I like it. Alright, then the common, another common is Heretic Dragon of Esset. Nice job. And then... Secret Rare Tardy Orc. Secret Rare Tardy Orc. La la la, yay. And then, uh, Ga -ga -ga Gardner. So, alright. Putting these with the other cards right here, and I'm still a noob. Which I don't care about. <laughs> I have to actually ask one of my fellow admins if he have ever opened packs before and knew where the special stuff was in. Alright, so I'm now going for the fourth and the fifth card instead of the fifth and the sixth, because it seems to be working that way. I'm glad I at least got the special rare, like. In the other pile, at least. Alright, Galactic Overlord pack number two. And we got... Let's move away. Eight, seven, six. Alright, five and four over here. We should have only commons now. Morpho Butter Spy. Watchill Dragon. Falling Currents. There's something with the light that's like reflecting off of like the, this part of the camera. Like light from my uh, lamp. So that's kind of showing. I'm like, eh, is this shiny? No, it's just a reflection. Radic Seal of the Sun Dragon Overlord. Berserk Scales. Light Ray Didelis. Uh-huh. And another Ascent. Okay. 
and then we got our rare, which is Light Ray Gear Freed. Woohoo! And our special rare, Queen Dragoonjin. And again, I don't have a clue what the rarity is, but I'm not going to check on my computer. So, uh, yeah. Noob. <laughs> you can all call me, if you wish, you can call me noob in the comments, but then please do. Do please uh, post a normal comment and then include noob in it somewhere. That's fine. Because I'm... I am a noob. At this, anyway. But I'm willing to learn, so then it will be noob with N-E-W-D and not uh, B. And not N-E-N-O-O-B. -N See? Now I'm... Like, I'm so excited about these Yu-Gi-Oh cards that I can't spell correctly. Alright, then it's one, two, three... These two away. I don't, most people don't do this with Yu-Gi-Oh, but I'm used to it with uh, Pokemon to put the rares away. But, um, Butterfly Oak, one of the cards that I haven't actually seen before, I think. Legosucho, Aqua Mirror Cycle, Camera Clops, Nimble Manta, another Heretic Seal of the Sun Dragon Overlord, and that Wacky Magic. And then we go to our rare, which today in this final Galactic Overlord pack is Nephthet. And there we got our third Heratic. We got a Nephthet and two Essets, so that's pretty good. And we got two Overlords and a Water Threat. So, and our special rare, a Tefnoid. Woo! Heratics are being collected as we speak. Alrighty. Where did I... Where did I put my rare? What the hell? What in the world did I do with my rare? I'm missing a rare. Where did I put it? Where's my rare? Huh? What in the world? Did I put it in the pile? I may have. I don't know. Where is it? I'm missing a rare on the pile. Which rare did I just get? I'm serious. Which... Was it? No, I didn't know it was a rare. No, what was this? There was no special rare? That... I'm getting confused. Ah, noob, I'm not awake or something. I didn't sleep too well last night. But... Okay, I'll just search after the video and call myself a noob for missing whatever card it was. No, I think it was Nep that... I think there wasn't a special rare. That it's like not... There's not always a special rare or something. And that... then in that case, the fifth is the rare and the fourth is just a common. I don't know. Once again, new. Alright, finally, Return of the Duelist. Let's see what we can get from this final pack. Do I pull an Xyz monster? I already have an Xyz monster and Shockmaster. Oh wait, I already pulled an Xyz monster, of course. I got Korean Dragoon Jin. So, that's one of my goals. So, can I pull another? Let's see... Medolce Lesson, Overlay Region, Medolce Mufie, Medolce Babu, Compulsory Escape Device, Xyz Soul, and Catapult Zone. And now, what should be the rare, I guess? Medolce Tea Break. Well, without a lot of Medolce cards, that's not going to be too useful, but alright. <laughs> You know, I don't have that much cards. And finally we got... Prophecy Destroyer. I do believe that's quite the rare card. I Once again, I don't remember the rarity, but I'm pretty sure it is, because it looks all shiny, and the attribute is shiny, and there's little thingies in the card, in the artwork itself, so that's probably like an extremely rare card as well. So, that's pretty good, I say. I'm happy with uh, the results here, so... Let's see if I can, like, find the one rare that I missed, because I got, now, like, four rares and then five special rares. That would be, the four, five regular rares or something, and then... Did I miss it? Like, that fourth pack, I'm seriously a noob that I did not notice. But yeah, um, from what I actually put on the pile and did not forget, Zale Weapon Union, uh, Unicorn Spirit, Gargar Gartner, Lightweight Gear Freed, Medusa Tea Break. And for these special ones... Prophecy Destroyer, Erratic Dragon of Tefnoid, that's probably like the regular rare, so that should probably be on that pile. Queen Dragoon Jin, Tardy Orc, Secret Rare, and also an Evolts are sold out. So, 
I should probably be quite happy with these pools. All right, guys, please tell me what you thought. Did you enjoy this Hanzo tin opening? I sure did. It, it's been so long since I opened Yu-Gi-Oh. Um, so uh, I'm very happy that I got this. Got myself some Rescue Rabbit, Shockmaster, Tour Guide, Maxi, Hanzo. So, uh, yeah. I'm very, very happy with this. And, uh, well, some of these cards might just be used in Yu-Gi-Oh! Burst in the future. We'll see. All right, guys, this was Alka193. I hope you enjoyed. And if I forgot anything, I'll put it in an annotation. And, yeah, like, it happens sometimes. <laughs> All right, guys, it's my birthday, and it's been a great day, and I got a Hanzo tin. I got some pretty good pulls. Pretty sure they were pretty cool. Uh, I'm just going to check the rarities, like, in a moment on my computer. But, uh, yeah, they're probably really good. All right, guys. See you later. Happy New Year. Have a great 2013. Bye-bye.